Hello YouTube. Today I want to talk about some big developments that we've had in the jailbreak for iOS 5.0. Early this morning, Pod2G, who's a member of the Chronic Dev team, sent out a tweet with a link to a video that demoed an untethered jailbreak on iOS 5. Now, he ran this on an iPod Touch, and so he has he did not confirm whether or not it worked for the iPhone 4S or iPad 2, but he did say that the exploit still exists on 5.0.1, so it will be portable to the new version, and that you sh should not upgrade your device at this point because any future versions could possibly patch this exploit. Now, he has not given an ETA for when it will be arriving, but since he has it working on his iPod Touch, it most likely will be soon. And now I want to get into the second story, which is that according to a source who is close to the Chronic Dev team, the new jailbreak will work for the iPhone 4S and iPad 2. Now, the, well, once again, this is an untethered jailbreak, which is the big thing that people have been waiting for. And this source claims that since this is a user land jailbreak, meaning it's based on the software, uh, the same jailbreak should be able to work for the iPhone 4S and iPad 2, since it's not based on the hardware like the Lime Rain exploit is. Now, this is not entirely confirmed, but it, our source says that it is a, almost a sure thing. So, this is definitely big news for anybody that has had these devices, because this is the first jailbreak for the iPhone 4S, and the first jailbreak on iOS 5 for the iPad 2, something that a lot of iPad 2 and iPhone 4S owners have been waiting for. Once again, we don't know exactly when this will be coming out, but we can bet that it will be in the coming weeks, maybe even before the end of the year. It'll be a early Christmas present. But that's all we have for now. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Don't forget to check out these posts down in the description. See you later.